We have disturbed your computer time to produce you a Barney error. Barney was tragically burned to death by Trevor Phillips. Trevor spilled gasoline inside the entire house while Barney was in his downstairs bedroom. However, he did not catch Trevor burning the house down because Barney was watching Top Gear on Samsung TV+. Plus. But when the kaboomakers, the house was bursting into flames. And then... Later Barney was burned to death because he had nowhere to escape despite him surrounded by a big fog of black smoke. And in the aftermath he was sent to the hospital when firefighters put out the fire. The police did not catch Trevor Phillips running far away from the scene. And finally, Barney was unable to breathe because the black smoke was in his lungs causing him to get his life taken away. So I must advise you to do not power off your computer without any circumstances at all. Otherwise you will lose all your chances and Barney will get your computer crashed. You will be given 20 chances with no second opinions. So if you leave your computer alone during the error, Barney will gladly give your normal computer session back, depending on how patient you can be. The error will end at approximately 10 minutes, so it shouldn't take too long, even though the error title or timer will not be shown. The error starts now. Hey, you are not supposed to turn off your computer, which is the most common rule of a bar error that has been ignored countless times. Sometimes I question why does nobody listen to this rule. It's like they don't even know what little definition of do not turn off the computer. They're just acting like they are deaf or something these days. Anyway, since you turned off your computer once, you unfortunately lost a chance. Which means that you now have 19 chances left. I should kindly remind you to do not do it again. You understand it now, right? Good, now you can leave it alone for 10 minutes. But listen buddy, there should be something else you can do, like grabbing a bucket of popcorn to watch the Kung Fu Panda 4 movie, do some meditation, oh yay, and even make yourself some lunch. You can do the things while waiting, right? Well, I will take that as a maybe later. This is clearly not an opportunity to psychologically manipulate a deceased person, you know. Well, you should get it memorized because you're about to play with real fire in your body. Now it's 18 chances accordingly, which the number 18 reminds us of Kyle Busch from NASCAR. I will gladly say this again so that you can get the sentence inside your head. Do not turn off your computer. That's all. How about I unlock my computer, since I ran out of ideas that I owned? So hopefully it should be gone for a little while. Well, here goes nothing. Need I remind you that black and me counts as turning off your computer? Yes, it does. Now if you excuse me, let me push this picture board off the stage. Boy, I got to tell you, that big ass picture board is really heavy to push. But anyway, black in the computer screen will also count as turning it off. You know very damn well that you and I need to be visible in contact. Yay, I'm getting used to see this, but to be honest, I was quite expecting this to happen anyway. You already know how many chances you have left so there's obviously no reason for me to tell you. Because, well, let's be honest here, I really don't feel like it, or don't want to, nor like doing so. Just don't do anything stupid like that again, okay? Good, thank you. Can I ask? How the hell are you even strong enough to push the picture board? Are you even on steroids, or did you do a lot of work out? I mean by this point your arms are just so thin, while your whole body besides your arms is so thick. So because of you being a total ripoff of Dwayne Johnson, I'm still turning it off. Oh, I see how it is! Not only did you criticize me for using steroids, and talk about my fitness, but you also called me a prophet Dave Johnson about my fitness alone. I cannot believe you, how I don't see anyone laughing in front of the screen. Well, 
No, I don't. I mean, they obviously laughed. So there's no reason for you to tell me otherwise. I swear to the good lord, if you turn off your computer again, then I will be in evil mode. This is your final warning before you witness terrorism. So you better decide what you want me to be as for the rest of the area, depending on your actions eventually. I definitely need to know when to stop underestimating him sometimes. Well, come on out, Barney. Face me. I'm ready to see it. Dear God, you literally remind me of my nightmares. Listen, God damn it. You clearly have no one to blame but yourself after all this, and you obviously asked for it to begin with. I am now a bloody evil dinosaur. Instead of using my current voice, I have decided to switch it to my scary voice, because let me be clear, I honestly wanted to make this really more scarier, and it's already scary enough anyway. Now you have 15 remaining chances until you stop turning it off, even though I know you're still going to continue turning the computer off apparently. If you continue this, there will be hell to pay, believe me. Seriously, you are making a fool out of yourself. You're the real idiot for turning off your computer six times. Do you really want me to become nice again? No, it's too late for that. So in order for you not to witness the same amount of pain and suffering you are currently experiencing, stop turning it off. It's really that simple. I mean, come on. Just stop it. Well you literally gave me an error for no reason, so I won't hesitate to punch you in the face. That move is gonna cost you bad luck, which means the number 13 is clearly visible which is considered bad luck. As of right now you are hereby restricted for turning off your computer for 24 hours during the entirety of bad luck. Meaning that the power button will be permanently disabled for its designated time. Host stopping me now hut. No one including you can. Take that bitch. <laughs> Damn, didn't know the number 13 is considered bad luck. Hell you already gave me bad luck, which is a smart move you pulled. You know what my smart move is? It's this. Holy crap, I didn't expect it to be that easy. Well, good riddance. Suck my dick goodbye, you purple pervert. God damn it. I should turn down the PM mode on the double before my computer glitched out. And I thought hacking the error worked out easily, but I guess not. I pretty much lied to myself. Well, here he comes. Goddamn why the fuck do you have spikes on your long ass tongue? A normal sized tongue without spikes on is better but why am I seeing this? God I must be having a hallucination right now because all the power in this neighborhood is completely gone thanks to you. Now I'm scared. As you should be. Instead of taking away three chances from you, I have decided to take away eight chances permanently since you tried to hack my error. That was literally a smart move you did, but let's not get into this because it's time to be serious here. I am now the real monster that no one has ever seen before. I now have a long tongue with sharp spikes on my tongue, on my back, and on the top of my head because I am officially almighty powerful. No one can stop now. Five chances for you. Do not do anything else that will get rid of the air easily, otherwise your time will come. 
at this point I'm ready to kill your computer if you turn it off four more times. Your computer components are increasing to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. Don't you understand? I'm pretty sure all you care about is turning off the computer so many goddamn times and not listening to my instructions. Not your computer. You need to realize that your computer is your prized possession if you really want it back. The only way to stop this is if you listen to me just this once. And that's it. God damn it. Why are you still not listening to me? Are you really that ignorant? Or you just don't care about many of the humans of the race? How could you? That is just awful. But don't you worry, my child. It's about to get a lot worse. Turn it off three more times that I will unleash massive destruction to your computer. Clearly you don't even have a lot of money on your bank account to buy a new computer. Oh, wait, I actually got your email and password on your bank account, and I kinda hacked it. But there will be more money soon, trust me. You did what? My money is stolen because of you. Pardon me you little pussy fucker. I lost all my money and my bank account and it's all thanks to you. That's it, I'm ready to end you once and for all. It's time for me to stab you. That's what you get for stealing my money from me. And I've seen a lot of people committing bank robbery or credit card fraud so you are certainly no different. Well that's what you rightfully deserve anyway. Well that's just great. My computer has gotten disintegrated. Yeah, that's all on Barney. I'm blaming him for this. Since he hacked my bank account, there's actually no hope to get it back. But whatever, it was a good computer anyway.